So it is currently 8, 10 in the morning. Um, you guys know that we're going to get induced today at 9 in the morning. So we're going to head out to my mom's because she's going to come to the hospital with me. And yeah, you guys can see the chalkboard that I made for the baby. There. <clears throat> so the next time I'm in this house, it's going to be with the newborn. Hopefully, fingers crossed that everything goes good. So we got to the hospital around 9. It's 9.47 now. And they checked my vital signs and everything looks good and the baby's heartbeat looks good. My doctor's going to come in in a little bit and I think they're going to start by breaking my water because um, hopefully that'll get my body to go into labor by itself and not need the Pitocin or like be connected to any IVs or anything like that but I wanted to kind of guess the weight and and length of the baby so I think the baby is gonna be eight pounds and eight ounces and I think he's gonna be 20 inches long babe what do you think eight pounds nine ounces in 23 or 21 21 inches yeah uh lina usted que cree 8 y 10 okay de largo cuánto piensa 18 unas 20 20 pulgadas de larguito sí en uses i think 8 pounds Yeah. yeah, that's a good guess. And then, for my lucky number, that's it. <laughs> How long do you think he'll be? Um, 22. 22 inches long? Yeah, yeah. you think he's going to be long? Yeah. Duma? I think he's going to be 8 pounds and, and a half. And he's going to be about 21 inches. 21 inches long. And about 21 and a half. 21 and a half? Yeah. <laughs> I can say too, that's my birthday. <laughs> so basically everybody thinks I'm going to have a huge baby. But that's okay. Um, I'll let you guys know what happens after my doctor comes in. But we're just waiting for her right now. I think I'm going to do my makeup so I don't look crazy. So at 10.27, they broke my water. It just felt like a warm gush of liquid trickling down. And it didn't hurt, so I was kind of scared about that. It didn't hurt. I'm having contractions right now. They're not that strong. They hurt a little bit, but not that bad. So hopefully we get to meet baby Marcus soon. A few hours. Hopefully by the end of the day. Oh, and she checked me as well, and I'm at 5 centimeters and 80% of phase, so I'm really thin and um, like pretty much halfway there already. Hopefully it goes by really quickly. I'm so excited. I did a little bit of makeup, so I didn't look so scary, but by the end of the day, it'll probably be gone. Construction monitor right there. Mi sugar quiere salir de trabajar. Yo creo como al mediodía por ahí a la una. ¿Eso va a venir? Having a contraction right now. 
it didn't really hurt. Oh, so they're gonna monitor me for like 20 minutes, and then after that, they're gonna take um, all the monitors off, and then I can walk around and and um, do whatever I want, pretty much. So I'm probably gonna get on the bouncing ball first and then see if that does anything and then probably go walk around for a little bit. Is that how you're gonna spell it? Marcus? Yeah. Or are you gonna spell it Marquis? Not with a Q? You? Yeah. Marquis? <laughs> Marquis? Marquis. Marcus. 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 Brenda looks very calm. I'm very proud of my daughter. Look at her. contractions but they're stronger for sure they're a little inconsistent though like I had two like right back to back yeah. and then like now I'm just waiting for another one it just started I can definitely feel it in my back now it's not good versus like before I would just feel them right here my stomach my stomach would get tight and now, like, there in my back, like all through my back and to my stomach and like down here, I can feel a lot of pressure. Let's go, keep walking. And I'm leaking a lot. The contractions are right as soon as you pump your water out. Then you have things to put toes in there. Hopefully. Good thing you didn't get the IV.
are in the heat of the contraction, try like a low, like growl, like groan kind of thing um, to kind of just keep you under control because you're kind of going, you know, you're getting that out of control breathing and try to just and then like you can, you can vocalize, I mean, don't worry about what you sound like, but that low tone. Just over jumping. Yeezy, 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 just to go for jumping. Yeezy, 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 I feel so accomplished. I done talked a lot of shit, but I just did the numbers. I mean, it's just a silly. And that's a nigga who can get you. Sweet. 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 Come on, come on. Nice and control. She's a strong woman. I'll take some four by four. Good job. You did a good job, baby. You did a really good job. That's good. Incredible. Good job. It is 11 p.m. right now. That was the craziest thing I have ever done. I feel so blessed that everything went so smoothly. He's now asleep. Finally, we've been able to um, breastfeed as well. So that's going pretty good. It's a little bit painful, so I hope I'm getting a good latch. I'm gonna talk to the um breastfeeding consultant tomorrow but everything went so good he was uh seven pounds nine ounces and 20 and a half inches long and his name is marcus he's so cute i'm up with him right now um just because i'm not tired marcus Marcus going home outfit Bed. Yes. <laughs> I can imagine. I'm just going to tell the gal at the front desk while we're waiting for the elevator to come up that you're checking out. Oh, it's a cute little one. Oh, it's a cute little one. Oh, it's a cute little one. Come home, baby Marcus. Come home, baby. Okay. I'm going to go to the top of it. You have to get up. Yeah. 
We'll go home, little guy. Okay, this is your room, Marcus. Let's go show you. This is your house, okay? This is your room. This is your room, little guy. All your books. Okay. 